after being confirmed by the European Parliament, Ursula von der Leyen will lead the European Commission for a second term until 2029. Electing the President of the Commission is one of the first jobs of Parliament when a new term kicks off. To do that, a majority of the component members must approve the candidate. 401 MEPs voted in favour of von der Leyen in July 2024. She was the lead candidate of the European People's Party, which won the most seats in the Parliament during the 2024 European elections. Roberto Metzola, the European Parliament President, congratulated her on her new mandate. In 2019, von der Leyen was the first woman elected as Commission President, after leading Germany's Defence and Labour and Social Affairs Ministries. In a debate with MEPs, she said she would build on past successes. The last five years, we have shown what we can do when we work together. So let's do it again. Let us make the choice of strength. Let us make the choice of leadership. Let us make the choice of Europe. Thank you very much and long live Europe. The Commission President works with EU governments to select 26 candidates for commissioners, one from each country, and decides who is responsible for which policy area. Parliament then holds hearings to assess each designated commissioner and approves or rejects the commission as a whole. We will take our scrutiny role very seriously while working closely with the Commission President-elect in order to put the strongest possible team together. The role of the Commission includes proposing new EU laws on which Parliament and the Council of the European Union have the final say. It also manages EU policies, implements the EU budget and enforces EU law.